Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the study of success. Today, I'm going to be talking about something that most small business owners never even think about. This is for small business owners that have established themselves in what we call a storefront. They have an office space and they want to maximize that office space. There are certain things that they need to think about administratively as they build their infrastructure. They have to think about their IT, their information technology. So today I'm going to give you five IT topics that every small business owner should know. But before I get started, here is a message from our sponsor. This video is sponsored by Brain Fellow Accounting Solutions, where we offer premium bookkeeping, payroll, and tax preparation services at affordable rates. Let's see how we can service you. Send us an email with your contact information and get a free consultation. Here are the five IT topics that every small business owner or small organization should know. Number one, connectivity. That is your networking capabilities. That's things like your shared drives. That's things that will help your uh, employees or your staff or your team stay connected to each other and connected to the work. That helps increase your productivity when the files that you're using are accessible and can be accessed from different or multiple locations. Number two, cybersecurity. That's your encryption or your endpoint protection. There's nothing like the feeling of being hacked. It makes you feel vulnerable. So encryption and endpoint protection is very important to your, your computer, your network system. Your IT concerns, usually uh, from your IT person, will let you know all the different things that you need to employ or execute or install into your system to keep you protected. Cybersecurity is just as important in today's age and time as physical protection. Like if you're selling things and you have inventory, you have to protect your inventory the same way you have to do with your cybersecurity. You have to be able to protect your information that comes in and out of your system. Uh, number three, collaboration. That's your productivity. That's how you interact with your team uh, via your network or via your, your, your cyber uh, systems. So that is the things that you put in place like MS Teams or SharePoint, Google Drive, uh, Dropbox, OneDrive, Voice. Those platforms help increase your productivity by allowing your team to work as a single unit as though they were face-to-face -face when they don't actually have to be face-to-face. -face. As long as they're connected to your network, so as long as they're connectivity, you can have collaboration so that the work can be done in a flawless and effective way. Number four, business continuity. That has to do with data protection, retention, backups, compliance, and if you're dealing with medical records, HIPAA. There are certain things that have to be done in order to protect your clients or your customers, patients data. And you, the way you set up your IT system, your business continuity allows you to ensure that your operations can continue in case of a shutdown, a breach, or anything that can cause or disrupt the flow of your work. That's where retention and backup uh, become very, very important. And in a lot of cases, uh, there are certain laws in place that says that you have to have certain records for certain periods of time, whether that be accounting records or medical records or property ownership records, depending on what it is, it can range from three years, five years, seven years to 30 years. It's important to know what rules and laws and regulations that you work under so that you can make sure that you're in compliance with those. Number five, web presence. That goes to websites. It goes to social media, Google Business, uh, Yelp, anything that gives you a social media platform, whether that be LinkedIn or Facebook or uh, uh, Pinterest, um, uh, Instagram, TikTok, whatever it is where there's a, a social media platform or Twitter social media platform 
Uh, you have to have a presence there in today's age and time because that gives you a voice in front of many potential customers or clients. So those are the five IT topics that every small business or organization should know and work on. This is why we always recommend if you're small, you're not gonna hire a full-time IT person, but you should definitely have an IT consultant. This study has been useful. Please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and hit that like button. Hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time we upload new videos on business-related topics, and don't forget to share. Success is one of the keys that leads to the good life. And as always, I look forward to seeing you in the good life.